I have been, um, good evening. I have been given only five minutes to talk about a program which I could discuss with you for all five days um, that some of our NASA personnel will be here. So uh, uh, forgive me if I speak a little quickly. That program is the NASA Student Ambassadors Program. And we are only a few of the ambassadors who help bring the NASA mission across the country every day. I have this clicker that should do things. OK, cool. Um, our NASA student ambassadors are NASA interns and fellows, so undergraduate as well as graduate students, and um, some people who have comp completed their programs who have actually joined the workforce. And the requirements are success successful completion of their program, either their internship and fellowship, followed by nomination um, from their mentor. So these are students who went through their programs and were then recommended for the ambassador's program by their mentor. We engage in education, outreach, and service, and raise awareness of the NASA mission. The reason we need these ambassadors is because we have sites here at these locations. And there's a lot of space around those sites. I come from North Carolina, which isn't that far um, from some of our locations. Obviously, nowhere near as bad as if I were in the middle of the country. But I'm still not close. And when I hear about NASA is when something goes wrong. I hear about it when there's a project over budget and behind schedule. I don't even know when there are launches. My first internship was at Kennedy Space Center, where obviously the launches occur and where Everything is about NASA. The entire community is built around Kennedy Space Center. There are people, just everyday citizens, who follow all of the shuttle missions. And they, they know it's scrubbed before it's been announced at Kennedy. <laughs> uh, and we want to bring those ideals and that kind of enthusiasm about NASA everywhere across the country. I'm working to bring it at my home in Charlotte, North Carolina. Um, by forming a network. The NASA Student Ambassadors virtual community is our online space to gather and network with other ambassadors, with educators, with people working for NASA to find opportunities for outreach, for potential jobs, and to collaborate on ideas for reaching out. For instance, my area of focus is on educational technologies, which means I make games. Um, obviously to teach things, but still making games is cool. And it's the kind of thing that gets people involved in computer science, a diverse audience of people involved in computer science. So I do game development outreach in middle schools. And we've had a wonderful response and have actually developed a full 10-week curriculum for this program. And it gets middle school students at high-risk schools, high poverty areas with a lot of gang activity, in and around Charlotte, it gets these students engaged in something beneficial, not using technology, but creating it. And it's these kind of projects that our NASA student ambassadors are working to develop across the country. And the NASA student ambassador virtual community fosters this, and we're trying to leverage it more and more effectively. Um, as you've already heard, if you don't update your website every day, no one will use it. And it's been my job this past summer working with Dr. Mabel Matthews at the Office of Education at headquarters to make sure that our website is being used properly. Um, I actually talked incredibly quickly. Um, and have a, did anyone understand anything I said? Was it too fast? Excellent. Um, so the Student Ambassadors Program is all across the country. I think we now have ambassadors from every state. If not, we are very close to having ambassadors in every state. Those of you who are representing universities or institutes that are looking for a NASA representative to come out and speak to your students or trying to find a way to engage your students and convince them to come to NASA, to come and do our internships and our fellowships and utilize our scholarships for their education, invite an ambassador. We might not have flown in space yet, but we still have exciting things to say about our experiences on our NASA centers and the work that we've done. And there's no better way to inspire a student than let them hear about from a student who has already been inspired about the work they've, they've done. So utilize us. That's what we're here for. And thank you for listening to me. I'm going to pass it on to our next ambassador.